Hi, my name is ADV from Activity Messenger, and in this video, we're gonna create a payment form using Stripe. So Stripe's gonna need the back engine to take the payment, but on top of that, we're gonna create all these different options of how and what you're selling uh, to your client. So this is mobile friendly, really made to be able to have quick transactions on people's phones. So you can add an Im image to make it like brand specific. We integrate with Canva and that's pretty simple to do. Um, then in this example, I have a class. So if I wanna modify my class, I just click on edit. And then I would have all the you know information, location, schedule, different payment plans, uh, pricing, etc. Then I go down and I have a waiver and a digital uh, a liability conditions, you know, refunds, whatever it might be, uh, with a digital signature. Now, what I want to show you, if I click on the plus here, and I'll have multiple other questions I can build that form around to make sure you know I I get the right information from my clients. But if I click on e-commerce, that's where I have all these different uh, invoice op options or things I can sell on that same form. So I can bundle all different options together, right? So the first one I have is a judo class, uh, but I might wanna sell multiple classes on that, on that form or have people choose between multiple classes. Uh, are you selling tickets for your events? So it's the same concept, you're gonna create all the dates and everything, but this time they're gonna get a ticket with a QR code to be scanned at the front. Uh, might be products, so if I click on product, I can create or even choose a product that I, that I have here. So. Maybe it's a leotard, but maybe it's even a gift card. So I can even sell virtual gift cards. So if I click on choose here, I just added the gift card option to my to my form. And then it's very simple drag and drop. So let's go bring it back up uh, here. Now, if I want to add something else, I click on after. I can add donation, fundraising, variable invoice items, any type of invoice item, right? So I can, you know, create randomly uh, invoice items for, let's say, extra children for a birthday party booking or... Um, you know, t-shirts or anything like that that you might be selling. You can add them in the invoice item, auction items. Uh, you can also say, hey, I, I want to add a membership. So I want people to, you know, get a membership through this payment form. Uh, so let's maybe go for the judo membership here. You can see there's a price, $250 a month. Uh, you know, we're not going to invoice existing members. So there's a bunch of little things. I just click on create. And now all these options are created on the form, right? Um, and you kind of build it as you go. I'm gonna go into payment, make sure that I got my, so the payments by credit card, and then I can even charge a credit card fee. Uh, so I can kind of, you know, cover the cost of the, the, the Stripe transaction uh, on the form as well. Um, and if I go to visit or fill it, this is kind of on the back end what we would see. So uh, on the back end here, I have like a Harry Potter team demo account, but you can add your, your logo on, on, on both sides. Um, and then, you know, obviously this is a bit of mix and match, but people can register for a class. You can add multiple classes. They can say, Hey, I want to pay for in installments. You can bring up gift cards, you know, select a, a judo membership for, and then people, all they got to do is put in their information into the uh, account under here, click on next. And I have my assumption of liability, electronic signature, click on continue. And then that's where kind of the bundled invoice comes into play and everything is kind of added to the to the form here. Um, and then you can pay now for this amount and pay later, depending on different payment plans that you might have set up. People put their credit card and they're good to go. So that's how you can create a very customized uh, payment form using Stripe.